in this video we have been given that angle abq is 45 degrees ab is 10 cq is 8 and pq it is 3 times ap then we have to find area of cpq so we have pq it is 3 times ap that means if ap is x then pq it will be 3x if ap is x then pq it will be 3x and now if we join ac then area of acp it will be 1 over 2 times base is ap times height suppose h and it is 1 over 2 times ap is x times h and area of qcp it will be 1 over 2 times base is pq times height is h and it is 1 over 2 times pq is 3x times h so from these two equations we can say that area of qcp it is 3 times area of acp that means if this area is a then this area it will be 3a and this now from point a if we make a perpendicular on bc we have cq is 8 and suppose this point is m then in triangle abm it is a b m this angle is 90 degrees this angle is 45 degrees and ab is 10 so am it will be ab times sin 45 degrees and am it is equal to ab is 10 times sin 45 degrees it is 1 over root 2 and it will be 5 times root 2 so we get am is 5 times root 2 and now area 
of AQC, it is area of ACP plus area of QCP and area of AQC, it will be 1 over 2 times base is QC times height is AM. It is equal to area of ACP is A plus area of QCP is 3A and it is 1 over 2 times QC is 8 times AM it is 5 times root 2 it is 4A and 2 times 4 is 8 and 4 will get cancelled. So, 5 times root 2 it is A. So, we get A it is 5 times root 2. And now area of CPQ it is 3A and it is 3 times A it is 5 root 2 and it will be 15 times root 2. So, we get area of CPQ it is 15 times root 2. It is 15 times root 2.